Marco Stovanovic steps up to the plate with runners at first and second. Nobody out. And a big situation for the Vikings who chase three on the scoreboard. And Stovanovic watches strike one go by him. Two, two unique things that I'm seeing here. Rocco, who, like we said, has a ton of power the opposite way. Uh, Carthage electing to have second baseman Evan Devine hold uh, Bobby on at second base. He is he is jumping off the base uh, right when the pitch is thrown, but Rocco kind of pounds that 34 gap. He is back at the... Oh, oh he goodness. got a hold of that one! Oh, and boy. it's gone, yay! Whoa! That one, one hops into the softball bullpen right there. And what I was just about to say about the about the pitcher there, Schnabel, he's kind of got that funky sidewinder uh, style. And, and, you know, the thing about that is a lot of players step up and they try and hulk the ball, and then they end up just blooping it, you know, a high pop-up in the infield. But Ronko Stavanovic right there, he treated that like it was slow-pitch softball or something, and he hulked it all the way uh, almost out to Foster. One swing of the bat, the Vikings senior third baseman has tied the game at nine. Yeah, we were talking about how uh, how he was hitting the ball well as we get a savvy uh, bunch show by the freshman DeVito after the home run, trying to catch the infield napping. But um, we, we talked about how Ronco was hammering the bottom half of the ball just a little bit too much in uh, two of his at-bats specifically. That one, he got it again. Uh, good, uh, gosh, I'd say good between 390 and 400 foot home run. Like Scott said, one hopped into the North Park softball bullpen.